Indianapolis 500. The events that have happened here, there's nothing like it anywhere else. That's our Super Bowl. That's our that's our Coliseum. You know, when it comes to off road, that's the that is the place. Um, they've been around the longest. They've been at it the most, and they built a reputation unlike no other. High speed jumps and stuff like that. So it's a lot of fun to race on, but. The fans make it what it is. The track is more legendary. It's it's not as super cross feeling. It's more floaty and wide open, and it's like a balancing act, right? Like here, you might gain a second here, but you're gonna lose it here, and it's just like being the the top of dog of short course off road. What more can you say about it? You got turn one. You got 50,000 fans. Heck, last year you had Kid Rock. I mean, it's everything you want, and to be able to come here and say, yeah, that's where I grew up. That's where we started racing. That's where we started driving. Is it's something a lot of people can't do. You know, it's it's the race that people come out of the woodwork just to race sometimes, you know. So it's still got, uh, you know, the, the, all that prestige and everything it deserves. We've had great success there, and um, I'm looking forward to get back in front of my hometown crowd, friends, family, and getting back to some racing. It's just an exhilarating feeling. It's just completely different, and I always say that if you are on, into off-road racing, and you have not been to Fall Crandon, you're definitely missing out. If you've never been to Crandon, you definitely need to check it out. It's some of the best racing and some of just the best entertainment you'll find.